Hello everybody, welcome back to EU4. My name is Cilantro, playing as Morocco. Uh, looks like Aragon is getting checkered up pretty nicely. That means that Castile is going to be forming Spain, I would imagine. We'll see. Uh, last time we were starting to expand our colonies. We were trying to get up into the Americas. Uh, and hopefully get a really solid foothold before England starts uh, colonizing too aggressively. Uh, I'm hoping that... Portugal continues to just want to do the Caribbean Caribbean because that gives me more time to do America and that would be really nice um, I, I feel like having all of this here is gonna make it very difficult for anybody to, other than me to colonize over this way okay we just finished Puerto Rico excellent if I was smart I would have looked up in between episodes exactly which places I needed to colonize in order to get uh, this done but I am I can at least guess that it's somewhere in what I know to be the modern day Georgian area one thing I am worried about is I don't I don't 100% know how the whole Federation things work Federation thing works I don't know if being next to them if they would attack me or if it's just a defensive thing and at this point I don't want to risk it. I don't have enough troops to be able to handle uh, their potential aggression. My manpower is low. So I'm just going to colonize along the coast for now. That'll help prevent anybody else from colonizing here at all, which would be ideal. And I generally just want to uh, you know, do what I can to be conservative here. Um, I'm going to take the admin power. I'm behind on all the text, but I'm going to need more admin power for my ideas as well. So. It would be nice to get my power projection up to 50. I'd have to take a lot of land to do it. Uh, but that would give me even more monarch points. Although it's also going to cost me monarch points, obviously, because, uh, you know, having to annex or whatever. Some country. I'm hoping the, either the Ottomans or Tunis lose a war and that alliance gets broken. Because I would easily go in on Tunis here in the near future. Uh, hey, look at that. Cibola. So, 50 years of five ducats a month? Are you kidding me? I am there. Yes, please. That's amazing. I'm just going to keep leveling my techs as soon as I get them until I get caught up. Okay, so they have they have landed in Chesapeake, so that's fine. Um, just gonna park my dudes here for now. And our explorer guy's doing a good job. Hoping he'd find more native tribes. Actually, I think I'm gonna take over manually for a little while. We're gonna explore. Actually, here's what we're gonna do. We're gonna go this way. Oh, what are you doing? I don't want to go all that distance. I want to go here. Like that. I want to explore down this coast. Bloom, bloom. I will give you military access. Why not? Council of... Something related to Jeebusy stuff. I don't know what's going on. My ships are just kind of sitting out here, and that is really not smart. That is exactly how you lose them due to naval attrition. Invest in a new idea. Too bad I need to. Inv oh, actually, I. Yes. Faster colonists would be great. I would actually love that. I do want to get more tax, but. Bad discipline for 10 years. Really need the manpower. I don't like losing discipline because it's really powerful. I'm hoping I don't really fight anybody except for natives in the near future. So I don't really need it too much, but we'll see. Oh, we got an extra five ducats a month from tax. Oh, it's five ducats a year. Okay. 
thought that was a little ridiculous. That's still great. Still 0.42 ducats for 50 years is that's, you know, I'll, I'll take it. Gladly. Gladly, gladly, gladly. Yeah, I gotta let that manpower recover. Poor Aragon just getting beat up. France is all over the place. Oh, that's all one war. Wow. Savoy, Aragon, Tuscany. <laughs> Wait, that's Aragon land? I thought it was, I thought it was Milan because it's really close to it, but I guess not. Uh, yep. Keep my colonial progress as high as possible, please. Because these next two colonies are going over to... Oh, Holland is starting to colonize now. Not super surprising, as they did historically colonize quite a bit. Alright, so we have finished exploring down this way at least a little bit. Alright, now you guys go for the seven cities. I just wanted to see all the way down here. Two twenty-three, two thirty-six per month. How are we doing on? Oh, my conquistorino passed away. That's not good. That sucks. So I have nine more man or nine more army size I can go for. Um, are there any cool buildings I can build? Maybe earn a couple more ducats. Now's the time for some long-term investments, if there's any that are actually worthwhile. 16 plus... Ooh, wow. I don't know what place that is, but I'll take it. Uh, no longer claim that Madeira would be part of our realm. That's fine. Marin Howe. Just attacked again. Probably should uh, park my troops there, huh? Or at least a couple troops. You guys go there. Keep those dirty little upstarts from upstarting. Get a new conquistador, and you go back to exploring for seven cities, please. All right. Two diplomats that are free. Portugal, Castile, still no. Okay, so I guess they got out of there without Aragon dying. It's kind of interesting. Hungary, Austria, is there any chance of scoring an alliance somewhere around here? Nope. Okay, lost in mind and space. Sent out the hunter again. Yep. I'm always willing to go explore and look for things. Really nice to get like an alliance with England or something. But they're allied with Portugal, so it's not going to happen. I just cannot score any... Good, good allies. I mean, these guys are okay, but not ideal. Portugal started colonizing down this way. Castile's going down that way. That's fine. I want the Americas. That's all I care about. The rest of this place can go die in a fire, as far as I'm concerned. Chance of getting the Ottomans to like me again? Try. We can try. Alright, hopefully that reduced my colony's liberty desire a little bit. There we go. 22. Okay. Much better. All right, finish another colony. Excellent. That means we can start expanding in the Americas again. I think I want to go down the coast. Also, can I fabricate a claim here? No, I cannot. New domains. I will take that.
I'm still not exactly sure how I can get that. Hopefully it's within coring range now. Because uh, the last war it wasn't. So if I do go to war with Portugal, I'd love to take that. I still can't believe they beat me by like one day. Ooh, El Dorado. Pff, definitely want to find El Dorado. I wonder how many of these are based on like real world. I mean, I've heard of El Dorado. Some of the other events I've had pop up, I've never heard of before. And it makes me wonder if there is some sort of pseudo historical legitimacy to what these events represent. Uh, oh boy. Uh, I don't want to lose the stability right now. I cannot afford it. I cannot afford it at all. Is are still doing a good job exploring. Looking for the seven cities. I'm just trying to think back to whether or not any of the countries who were doing this sort of fabled exploration thing actually found anything that represented what they were looking for. You know what I mean? I'm sure meeting the Incans and the other Native Americans, Southern, Na Native Southern Americans, uh, uh, was quite a profound thing. I just wish we hadn't, you know, sort of killed all of them. Ugh. This game has really made me like. I, I feel like you should. I feel like this game should be mandatory play for people in high school or something. Oh, more long pig, really? Quit eating people. Silent Green is not very tasty. Stop it. Still really far behind. Uh, 42. Hey, we're getting close to be able to reset this. That'll be good. I need all the Monarch points I can get, damn it. I need to get my techs up. I don't like being behind. It's bad. It's very bad. Hopefully I can keep dropping my piety, too. It'll help out a lot. Let's use our enhanced diplomatic reputation. Alright, another colony done. Uh, reclaim Oran, improve our prestige. Let's do the improve our prestige. That seems a little bit more doable. So my colonies are firing off and I've got these other events that are really nice. Will I ever lose this as a core? Is this one of those permanent cores? Uh, 1673. I've still got a lot of, a lot of time left yet. Alright, got the conquest CB there, so that's good. Timbuktu cancer with military access, that's fine. Not really concerned. Um, Holland. How are you on your ideas? So they also only have exploration ideas for now. So that's good. Uh, let's see if there's any more improvements we can do. We do need to start uh, hiring our army up. Aw, El Dorado, womp womp. I kind of figured that would happen. Yeah, I guess I can just hire my military back again. So, what do we have here? We have... I guess I can check my total, total balance here. So, eight units of that. Three, so, okay, so I need more cavalry and more artillery. Definitely a lot more artillery. So let's go one, two, come on. Two, three, four. This may actually give me the option to take the manpower mission eventually. Actually, we need just lots of artillery. There we go. Excellent. Diplomat's still available. Naples, any chance of getting you as an ally? I've already improved relations with you. France, Austria, Hungary. A lot of these guys are just too far away, really, even. What about the Mamluks? Not that they're really that great. In fact, they're likely to be attacked, and I really don't want to get called into wars because of it, so. Alright. I would love to lose some more piety. Thank you. Even cheaper text? Yes, please. All right, we need to upgrade our navy. You guys, eighteen point seven two ducats to upgrade one ships. Ooh, 
who that? Who's that, and how can I conquer them and take their money? Why are we losing ducats all of a sudden? I swear things are so swingy sometimes. Charua! Where are you at? Ah, okay. Oh, hello. Hello, how are you guys? Let's try check level four. Okay. So I colonize here and I take them out. Bam. Can I actually... Wait, why am I... Conquest of... It is Uruguay. Wow. Yeah, I guess that is the location of modern day Ur Uruguay. Which I only really know thanks to... Uh, what's the name of that show? The John Oliver Show. Last week tonight. Uh, Tunis gets to claim on Dara. Eh. Seriously, why did I... Did I just lose an event or something? How did I just take a loan? What's going on here? I just suddenly started hemorrhaging money. I don't think my... I don't think these cannons are that expensive, are they? Maybe they are. What's their maintenance cost? Oh. I guess they are that expensive. Holy moly. I didn't realize how expensive the cannons were. Okay, well, lesson learned. Uh, what can I do to alleviate that? Where's my navy? I changed my mind. I'm gonna, I'm gonna mothball these guys. You guys head. Whoa! Nope. 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 Go kill them. Can I, is this technically a rebel? I don't know. I've, tr I think I've tried that before and it didn't end up working. Why do I not have these on? Pop up and pause, please. Thank you. Alright, Navy. Uh, you guys come over to the mainland and mothball yourselves. Save me a couple ducats. Hick mm, Sunt Draconis. Hick. Hick Sunt. Interesting. Six-legged monster. Okay. Uh, 50. We're going to take the admin power. I need that more. We have, an, we have an admin idea group. Maybe I should focus admin, actually. Which I can do now. Um, because we do, it, is, it is an admin idea group. Yes. Yes. Okay. We're going to do that. That'll help us get caught up not only in tech, but in that. I'm actually not super worried about... And there it is. <sighs> Crap. Well, I guess it's about that time. About time to beat up on their navy. How's how's their navy actually looking nowadays? <laughs> Not all that great, although probably a hell of a lot higher level than mine. Uh, get these guys to come home. So again. Focusing on naval superiority here. And I'm not in a port, so I can't do that. And actually, their navy is split right now. Can I get here? Coast of... Where? Pernambuco? Yes, please. Why, I would love to fight you guys there. Hopefully, they get there before my... Why are my guys getting destroyed right now? Oh, now they're not. All right. Well, thanks for the navy, broski. Um, okay, so what did he make the Wargle? He made the Wargle Ciuta. Good to know. So let's go crush his other navy, and this war's over. Hopefully. <laughs> I can't get too cocky about it. How are we always... How are we at minus one? We've won naval battles, and why are they not showing up? I don't understand that. Did he call these guys in as co-belligerents? Because I don't think I ever—I don't think I actually had to call them in. I guess it all—I guess it automatically happened. Okay, so he brought Castile and England. Oh, okay, England being in is a problem. England's navy is no joke. That is a big problem. God, what is with the AI and their huge giga? Ugh. Yeah, that's 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 a problem. We may still be able to hold this, but that is a lot scarier. Actually, Castile has a little bit of a navy now, too. And there's England. With their transport ships. Can I cut 
those guys off. I wonder where they're going. These guys are going to Cape Boador. Alright, we need to drop down to 3x speed. Why are these guys not fight? I don't understand why it does... Okay, there we go. Why am I at such a negative whatever? I don't understand that. Why did my morale already tank to nothing? I There are so many things I just don't get in this game, I swear. Did they just retreat? They just retreated. How did they get out so quick? Or did I wipe them? I just wipe them? There's no way I just wipe those guys. Uh, There's probably a way to see the history. I don't know, though. Alright. That colony is done. Those guys just decided to rise up. Send that colony there. If I can just keep getting these... They must have retreated. They did. How did they get out of combat so quick? That's what I don't understand. Alright, well things to figure out. I will see you guys next time on some more for some more EU4. Take it easy everybody.